Well, look here, what we got here? Hold on, folks. Don't go by too fast. Now, hold, hold up there, Zach. Come on, close in here, folks. Come on, right in here, close. Come on, I don't want to make me talk too loud now. Come on, right on in here. Let me speak to you folks here for a minute. Well, how y'all doing tonight? Beautiful summer night out here, right? Hey, yeah, welcome. Well, my name's Samuel J. Garrett, you see, and I'm an entrepreneur. Y'all know what an entrepreneur is? Hold on, you I'm a self-made businessman. You see, I work for myself. I, I don't work for nobody else but myself. And what I do, I do anything it takes to try to make a dollar, you see, right? I suppose what you folks have from been... the dead? Excuse me? I said including robbing from the dead. Well, I sort of take offense to that comment. Don't listen to this one. Anyway, as I was saying, you see, you folks, I'm sure you heard news about the big war going on here the last few days, right? Well, see, what I do is I go out on the battlefield and the camps and stuff, and I pick up odds and ends and stuff Why, you know, you folks need something to remember this great war by, right? You need a souvenir or something. Well, that's just happened to be what I'm selling tonight. War souvenirs is what I call it, right? So what do you folks say? Let's take a look. Why, you know what? People, they call me a bad name sometimes, and I do take offense to it. Why? You know, they call me carpetbagger. Well, why do you suppose they call me carpetbagger? Well, I don't know. Maybe it's because my bag here is made of carpet. I don't know, maybe. But anyway, what do you folks say? Let's take a look, see what we got inside, right? Y'all want to see some stuff? Well, let's take a look. Well, looky right here. I got a nice haversack off a soldier right there. Now, we got some stuff inside. Why don't we just take a look, see what we got? All right. Well, it's getting an eye on supper time, right? Folks are getting hungry, right? Well, thinking about maybe having a bite to eat. Okay, well, let's take a look. Well, we got a nice dinner plate right there. I'll tell you what. We'll start the bidding off right there. Five cents for that tin dinner plate. Now, wait a minute. We gotta have accoutrements with a dinner plate, right? Because that's just a dinner plate. You gotta have something to go with it, right? Okay. Well, we got the nice tin cup right there. Well, the tin cup's empty. We gotta have something to fill it up with. Well, I tell you what, I just happen to have a nice canteen right there. Now, that don't got no water in it. You gotta go fetch that yourself, of course. But if you fill that up, nice cool water, dump right in it, you got yourself a nice drink. Well, I tell you what, hold on. Let's see. What else we got? You gotta have utensils, right? Well, I just happen to have that right there. There's your, there's your fork, there's your spoon, there's your knife right there. Okay. Throw that on there, but hold on, hold on. Get kind of dark out here. We need to have ourselves a candlelight dinner. We'll set that up right there, light her up. We'll have ourselves a candlelight dinner. Well, we're missing something else, I'll tell you what. I'll throw in some nice Yankee hot tack for nothing right there. Free. Okay, everything you see right there, let's say 50 cents for everything right there. Any takers on that? No takers on that yet, okay. Well, let's see what else we got, okay. We've had our meal, we got a candlelight. What else we need? Why, well, by golly, we gotta have some dinner music, right? Well, how about a nice little harmonica? Works just fine. How about five cents for the harmonica? What do you say? No takers on that yet? Okay, no problem, that's fine. Well, I say, well, let's, how about the jaw harp? We'll put ourselves a band together. How about 20 cents? Five cents for the jaw harp. Any takers on that yet? What oh, tough crowd tonight? Okay, no takers on that yet. Well, let's see. All right, we've had our supper. And what, what, what we do after supper? We gotta clean up a little bit, right? Well, how about a nice wood comb right there? See, now the fella I got that off of. He has his clean hair right there, had no lice or nothing. I picked it clean. I wouldn't lie to you, folks. And that's a good used wood comb right there, right? Uh, it's 10 cents for the comb now. No takers on there yet. Alright, well, after you eat your dinner, what you gotta do? Well, you gotta brush your teeth, right? Well, how about a nice used toothbrush right there? See, now the fella I took that off of, he's gone for clean. He had no scurvy or nothing, right? Okay, that's a good pig bristle toothbrush right there. I always say, folks, five cents for the used toothbrush. No takers on that yet. Okay, well, that's not a problem. All right. Well, all right, you cleaned up. You had you want to sit down and relax a little bit. How about a nice after-dinner smoke right there? There's a nice cool call pipe. There's a hunk of tree bark right there. Well, I tell you what. I'll even throw in the fine Southern Virginia tobacco for nothing. How about that? Right there. Smoking pipe tobacco. Let's say two dollars right there. No take us for any of that stuff. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Well, I'll tell you what. Now, we had a lot of soldiers out there falling on the field. Right? We've got the Confederate States. we got the United States fighting each other. Well, you got to have yourself a belt buckle to remember them by, right? There's your Confederate belt buckle. There's your Union belt buckle. What do you say? Ten cent apiece for the belt buckle. Still no takers on that. Okay, well, that's not a problem. Ooh, now look you right here. There's a fine piece of machinery right there. A nice cold pocket pistol. A nice belly gun stick get right down in there. What do you say? It's a dollar fifty for the cold pistol. Somebody no takers on take that. take that and shoot you. Well, ma'am, I'm telling you, I just take offense to your comments tonight. Folks, just pay no attention to this woman right here. She just, she's not right in the head yet. Maybe she needs to. Uh, <laughs> look at here. Now, we got. Not one, but two. 
real nice shiny gold pocket watches. I'd say one dollar a piece for the gold watches. What do you say, folks? Hey, we got to take it back there. Show me the money, man. Now make sure that it's Yankee currency and that it's not that Confederate stuff because that's no welcome. We're up here in Pennsylvania now, so it got to be Yankee currency. Okay, well, let's see. What else we got in here? Well, how about a nice shaving razor, right? Because you got to clean up after you shave. Well, it's a little on the rusty side, but you can clean it up real good. What do you say, folks? No takers on the razor. Okay, well, let's see. Ah, now how about a nice Yankee hat right there? You see, now the fella that came off of, he was shot in the chest. You see, he wasn't shot in the head, so there's no blood inside the hat. A good, clean hat. I wouldn't lie to you, folks. Honest to Pete, right there, $2 for the Yankee hat. No tickets on that yet either. Okay, okay, well, let's see. What? Well, your feet got to get tired. How about a nice new pair of brogans right there? I'll sell you these pair of brogans. $2 for the pair of brogans. No tickets for Tough crowd tonight. Hokey smokies. Hokey. Well, all right. Everything you see right here on the table. Special offer. Put it on one to have a sack. Take it however you can take it. Five dollars for a whole lot. Take it or leave it. No, wait a minute. Special night tonight. Let's knock that price in half. Let's see. Now, wait a minute. What's half of five dollars? I can't think. What's half of five dollars? Two dollars and fifty cents. Whoever said that, congratulations. All right. Special tonight. Two dollars and fifty cents for the whole lot right here, folks. Any takers? Take it or leave it. No, nothing yet. Okay, one more thing right here, folks. Now, this is the coup de grace. Anything that you got wrong with you, aches, pains, constipation, hearing loss, toothache, sore elbow from throwing a ball around, right? Right here would be, yes, ma'am? Can I see that pocket watch? Why, absolutely, ma'am. Have, have yourself a look right there. I'll take the money anytime you're ready. Why, folks, right here, Garrett's homemade fine elixir. Can't take care of what else. Right here, what do you say? One dollar a bottle, folks. This Sir, is fine. Yes, ma'am. You said Garrett's? I did, ma'am. Is that Garrett's or Charles? Yeah, it is, ma'am. Would you like to buy a bottle? No, I would not. That stuff is poison. Well, ma'am. You sold that to my sister I last week for a toothache, and she nearly died. No, ma'am, that's not no, true. that's poison. Don't you people listen to me? Folks, don't listen to this. my husband's pocket No, ma'am, that's not. I you can't stole it. Far I found that out on the body. Yes, off his dead body. I gave this to him before he went to the hospital. She created it as she don't know what she's talking about. Facts, sir. You are a liar. You will see selling that stuff to me. Well, a man's got to make a living somehow. Well, the promo's got to tell you run out of here. Well, you can't do that. Come on, people. We don't need to listen folks, to this. Folks, don't listen. Don't leave, folks, please. <laughs> <laughs> it's good. Yeah. Oh,